We love our job here because twice a month we get to feature talented local designers in a new series we like to call The Lookbook. The Lookbook. <laughs> now today we are learning about a popular clothing line that combines both sustainable apparel with fashion. This is how you get the look. Men can never go wrong with Aloha shirts, especially in the islands of Hawaii, which is why I invited David Shepard, owner of David Shepard Hawaii, to tell us about his popular Aloha shirt line. David, good morning. Thank you so much for coming on Living 808. Good morning. Thanks for having me. Now, let's just get straight into it. I want to know, how did David Shepard, your clothing line, get started? Um, well, the clothing line came out of a, a with of the environment and of native Hawaiian plants and just plants in general. My background is as a botanist. I worked with the National Park Service, the Botanical Garden on Kauai, and then at Le or Lion Arboretum. So between all of those things, I just I've, I've always had a love of plants and of sharing that beauty with people. And I've also had a background in art in college. So all of that came together when I was working on the island of Molokai about five years ago. And I started working on design processes and I started learning how to sew and it just all kind of evolved into what it is today, but there's been a lot in between. That's awesome. I mean, it's cool how you brought all of your talents and merged them into one to create a really popular business that I have been seeing all over social media. So congratulations on that. Now, your designs are really nice and um, they caught my eye. They're, they're very eye-catching. What are the inspirations behind your designs? Well, it all comes directly from the land. So it's um, an extension of Aloha Aina. The beauty of the plant are what really in the landscape. And I think even the people that take care of them. So that whole combination goes into every piece. And then I get inspired by different things, like say the colors of a sunset or the, the way that the, the light hits the water in a certain way. Or maybe I see a painting in an art gallery and I think, oh my gosh, that color scheme is just perfect. And then I take all those little components and I start piecing them together. And that's what you end up seeing as the finished product, the, the design that I, that I do. Right. It's amazing. And uh, speaking of designs, we are getting out of our winter season and going into our spring season. I got to ask you, on behalf of all of the fellas out there that's listening and watching, what are some popular spring designs that you offer at David Shepard right now? Scarves, because they're endlessly useful. And, and you can pass them on. They make great gifts and it's very easy, you know? Long sleeve shirts right now, because it's a little bit cooler. I've come out with some of my most popular design long sleeves for men, um, as well as for women's aloha wear. Uh, right now, it's the makahiki season. We're still within it, so that's a time of rejuvenation of life, of new things happen. And so, for example, this shirt that I'm wearing right now, it's based on Molly, the lace on albatross, and that's a new print that's out right now, too. Perfect. Makihi season is probably the best because it's a good time, just like you said, rejuvenation, um, refreshment, um, and of course, all the bountifulness that is Hawaii. Now, if anybody wanted to shop David Shepard Hawaii, is there a website that they could log on to or even a social media account that they could follow? Absolutely. So um, my entire collection is on, it's davidshepardhawaii.com. Or you can also shop in person in the Mea Hawaii at Ward or at Mori Art and Flea, also at Ward. They each have different collections and not everybody has everything. Everything you can find on my website. And also, if you follow me on social media, on Instagram, the hashtag is David Shepherd Hawaii. Um, but the absolute best place to find deals is through my email marketing list, which you can sign up through my website. That's how you can get in on the latest of everything and the new deals. You have it all. Instagram, website, email list. David, thank you so much for coming on Living 808 and sharing your awesome designs. Everybody will have more information on kh12.com, including the direct link to David Shepard Hawaii so that you can do all of your early shopping for whatever occasion is coming up for you guys. David, thank you so much. I will talk to you later, man. Thank you so much. Looking forward to seeing you there. I love the designs and I love just how far Aloha Wear is coming, even make the masks look stylish there. You know, when I first came here and we had like clothing deals with different Aloha Wear and I felt not stylish in some of them, like I was wearing my grandma or Tutu's outfit, but now everything's sleek and stylish and slim fit and the patterns have really come so far thanks to the new crop of designers like that, Mikey. I totally agree with you, Tanya. Um, a couple years ago, we did this story on Living 808 
where we talked about how the evolution of, uh, I guess, um, Aloha shirts yes. came. And it was really interesting. We went to this, uh, oh my gosh, please forgive me. We went to this person's house. Mm -hmm. um, Dang. We went to the person's house and he had like all the Aloha shirts from like when Elvis was here to like wow. what we can see nowadays. And it's amazing to see where Aloha shirts came from. And the fact that David is incorporating sustainable apparel mm -hmm. into his lines, that makes it even more special because especially now everybody's trying to go green, have a little bit of a green thumb, right? Right, exactly. So uh, we <laughs> love it. Go check it out. Uh, and we, oh, and yeah. tell us about new designers too, because we love being able to be the first yeah. to bring you that scoop here on Living 808. Okay, shopping, we love talking about it. Americans <laughs> apparently were back to spending money last month, helped of course by those stimulus payments. In fact, the retail sales mm -hmm. jumped in January up 5.3%, increase much larger than economists were expecting. And excluding spending on autos, the increase was even stronger. We're talking 5.9%. The hike comes after three consecutive months of declines in retail sales during the all-important holiday season. Spending was fueled in part by that $600 federal stimulus payment for Americans and more generous unemployment benefits. Sales increased for furniture and electronics, retailers, department store chains, and, of course, restaurants and bars we know people here have been so excited to do that and you know we're doing the takeout before now you just have to follow by the five at a table rule but uh we're glad to see mm -hmm. our restaurants and bars getting back to business here yes for sure i know a lot of people are itching to get out so i mean even if a restaurant is open everyone they're gonna put on their david shepherds and go out so um like you said yeah it's pretty awesome that everything is slowly starting to get back to normal not quite there yet, but just keep wearing your mask. I know. We still have a lot more coming up.